I am Dr. Nanda Rajneesh. I am a surgical oncologist in Apollo Spectra Group of Hospitals and Sakra World Hospital. Sentinel lymph node is a first lymph node that comes in contact whenever there is a spread of the breast cancer along the lymphatics. So what happens is that when there is no clinical palpable lymph nodes or in the lymph node in the investigation also that means it is early breast cancer that means the breast cancer is very much confined to the breast but there can be microscopic and macroscopic metastasis of these cancer cells into the lymphatics which may not be visible as a palpable lymph node so in such situations we like to do what is called a sentinel lymph node biopsy what is the reason we want to do sentinel lymph node biopsy when we do axillary clearance and that is removal of all the lymph nodes for sampling and check the prognosis of the disease to know the stage of the disease there are a lot of complications and problems associated with removing of the lymph nodes when they are not involved so what we do is we try to check only one or two lymph nodes that are first pass of the lymphatic drainage and if that is positive then only we go for axillary clearance if that is negative we do not do the axillary clearance so there is a benefit of doing sentinel lymph nodes biopsy in early breast cancers how it is done is that during the surgery we first inject a dye and a technetium scan dye also and a methylene blue dye around the tumor and we detect the first lymph node with a dye scanner and also blue staining of the lymph node and it is sent for on table frozen section to check if there is any disease present in this lymph node if it is present we proceed with the axillary clearance if it is not pre present then we need not do axillary clearance in these patients so this is possible only in early breast cancers